Okay, little fit tip for the day. Rest and recovery. You know, we've heard the saying, you don't grow in the gym. That's very true. We don't grow when we're bench pressing. We don't grow when we're squatting. And we sure as hell don't grow while we're deadlifting. We grow while we rest. It is key. Yes, we need progressive you know, training in the gym. We need a proper diet. But without rest, you're not going to get that far. And Dorian Nates had a great analogy on this. He said, imagine if we were to take sandpaper and rub it against your palm. Do that every single day without end. What's going to happen to your palm? It's not going to heal. The tissue is going to break down and it's going to hurt like hell. But say we were to take our other hand and take that sandpaper and rub it maybe Monday, Wednesday, Friday, leaving you know, four days for rest. What's going to happen? That tissue is going to callus. It's going to grow thicker and stronger. You gave the body a stimulus, a stimulus, and it has to do something about it. So it's going to protect itself. It's the same thing in the gym. When we're in the gym and we're squatting, you know, 405 for sets of 10, you're telling the body, hey, listen, body, you need to get stronger. You need to get bigger because this is what I'm going to make you do. But if we don't give the body time to recover and heal from that, you're just spinning your wheels. So training three to four days a week when your goal is like to get as big and as strong as possible, it's probably ideal. Could you get by with like five or six days? Yeah, but it's not going to be as fast of progress and you'll probably just burn yourself out. So if your goal is to build muscle, try that. If your goal is to impress people by being a gym athlete and training every single day and doing crazy shit, keep at it.